The origin of Shadow Garden dates back to the boyhood of Sid Kageno, who was determined to fulfill his dream of becoming an eminence in the shadow. To accomplish this, Sid routinely snuck out of his home to fight against bandits within his vicinity. During much such outing, he discovered a rotting but surprisingly alive body, heavily mutated by demon possession. Originally aiming to relieve it out of its suffering, Sid noticed it possessing an abundance of magical power and gleefully took it to test his own limits. He performed multiple experiments on the body and accidentally restored the girl to her true self after a month of work. Thinking she might be useful to his cause, Sid fabricated a story and convinced the elf girl that she was the descendant of the one of the three heroes who defeated the demon Diabolos, the one responsible for cursing her bloodline with demon possession. The enraged girl then swore loyalty to her new master. Sid later declared his name as Shadow and named the girl as Alpha, and then they two co-founded the Shadow Garden. But before diving deep into this video, make sure to like this video and watch this video till the end so you will understand what is Shadow Garden and how powerful they really are. Ironically, Sid's fabrication was actually true to every detail, unbeknownst to him. And everyone else in the Shadow Garden knows this truth, while he believes it to be a role play. Together, Shadow and Alpha formed the organization Shadow Garden, which the Dio later recruited with six more girls within their first year, each possessing the same affection as Alpha and cured just as similarly. Shadow Garden is an extremely formidable organization with power and influence equivalent to the cult of Diablos. By integrating Shadow Wisdom, Shadow Garden was able to expand the organization's influence, provide the necessary resources, and recruit many members into their ranks. From their hard work efforts which resulted in developing the organization for two years, Shadow Garden possesses a well-trained army with skilled abilities, claiming the long-lost ancient capital Alexandria as their permanent headquarters, and had an information network of sources using public connections everywhere. In addition, they also have a considerable amount of resources and wealth thanks to their public friend the Mitsugoshi Company. Shadow Garden was initially established with only seven members, and their strength has been trained directly by Shadow, who is the organization's founder, managing to take down the strongest members of the cult, along with several of their important facilities and several of the oldest and strongest members of the Knight of Rounds, along with their candidates in just three years. After the Seven Shadow decided to leave their master in order to expand the organization, Shadow Garden has grown to power within their hidden headquarters Alexandria with the protection of the Mist Dragon, making their base look like a natural fortress. The Mitsugoshi company works as an important fundraising base that creates innovative products which are based on Shadow Wisdom to fund and administer their operations and missions. Also, their organization membership has now grown to over 600 members in just two years and is still increasing. Seven Shadows are the first seven original members recruited and granted power directly by Shadow himself, who having treated demonic possession symptoms in each girl, eventually turning them into most loyal direct confidants of Shadow. Each of them spent three years with Shadow studying and receiving all of his martial arts and magic training. So it can be said that they are each Shadow's childhood friends and disciplines. As Shadow's earliest subordinates, Seven Shadow stands in a league of their own within Shadow Garden, being the most powerful or skilled with exceptional abilities. Part of their blessing is due to Shadow, who bestowed upon them a part of his own magical energy. However, despite all that, their rankings as Seven Shadows is based on their sequential positions, which had already become a permanent title at the time they orderly joined Shadow Garden. Even though each of them has different level of capabilities in terms of physical strength and amazing skills they possess. Apparently, at this time, there are only two members other than Seven Shadows who received privilege of being granted powers directly from Shadow himself, considered to be the highest honor for the organization. These two characters are Victoria and Rose Oriana. According to Epsilon, they plan to make a second Seven Shadows with powers on par with the original first seven and so far Victoria is the only known candidate. While Rose qualified by having received her powers from Shadow himself, she publicly became a new queen of the Oriana kingdom and wouldn't be considered due to the conflicts of responsibilities. Espilon, the fifth member of the Shadow Garden, emerges as a character shaped by a noble upbringing and subsequent exile, leading to a quest for vengeance. Encountering Sid altered her trajectory of life, providing a renewed purpose. Despite being the weakest of the original Seven Shades, Espilon compensates with exceptional magical control and the ability to manipulate her physical appearance using a slim bodysuit, earning her the moniker The Precision. Eta Lloyd Wright, the lethargic purple-haired elf, is the head of the research faction within the Shadow Garden, focusing on the study of slime bodysuits. Her exceptional intelligence and translation skills sets her apart, positioning her as a vital asset 
located within the group. Beta, the organization's second member, operates as a lead analyst, utilizing the information gained from missions to the Shadow Garden's advantage. She embodies versatility, being adept in various roles, but not surpassing her fellow shades in any particular aspect. Delta, a beast kin and the muscle of the Shadow Garden, exhibits immense strength, often diving headfirst into confrontations. Her unrestrained power, honed through rigorous training since childhood, marks her as a dominant force within the Seven Shades. Alpha, the second in command, demonstrates a blend of determination and compassion. Her prowess as a swordsman and her growth in strength makes her a force to be reckoned with. Her skills in infiltration adds depth to the Shadow Garden's missions. And the final one is the leader and the protagonist Shadow, who is a masterful warrior and strategist, equipped with exceptional combat skills and magical prowess. His proficiency in martial arts and the manipulation of shadows establishes him as a formidable opponent, capable of extraordinary feats. The eminence in Shadow distinguishes itself from the saturated Isekai landscape by offering a rich tapestry of diverse and compelling characters, each contributing a unique skill set and depth to the intricate story, making it a standout within the genre. What are your thoughts about this video? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos like this. And that's it for today's video guys and I will see you in the next one. Sayonara.